that soccer is the most popular sport in France, right next to rugby, but also basketball and handball is popular. Did you know that France is the largest country in Western Europe? Huh? Did you know? Did you know that France is home to 29 UNESCO World Heritage Did Sites? Did you know that France is home to the Louvre, one of the largest art museums in the world? Did you know that the motto of the French Republic is fraternity, equality, and the majority of the French colonies came from Africa? So, alam na natin yung mga fun facts na yan. Pero may alam ba talaga tayo ng foreign policy ng France? We're gonna do an ambush interview. Mga ate, may alam ba kayong foreign policy ng France? Yeah, ikaw yeah, ikaw. Uh, yung quota sa Hollywood movies na pumapasok sa France. Parang, yeah. Ah, Bale, parang to relate like their siya. culture. Oh, alam ko yun. Yeah. Ang galing niya. Yeah, so, kuya, may alam ba kayong foreign policy ng France? Ah, sige, kuya. Salamat. May alam ka ba sa French foreign policy? French foreign policy? Uh, wala eh, sorry. Uh, Meron po ba kayong alam na foreign policy ng France? Wala ako. What do you mean? Yung... What, what kind? Foreign policy ganyan, about other countries or foreign policy about trade? Trade. About what? Trade though. Trade? Not the familiar. Ano po ba sa ako ng Euro? Na uh, as ehol na yon na uh, bawal na mga foreigner uh, na magtrabaho sa kanila. Ah. Sige, salamat po mano. Salamat po ya. Um, what is your opinion or what do you know of French policy? Well, yeah, that, that's a very interesting topic. Uh, what, what I know about it is that a few years ago when the European Union met they were sort of asking France, the, the president of, of France, about you know the the, the, the economic state of, of, of the country, because uh, you know, it, it was slipping compared to the other European nations, and they ridiculed him when he told them that they should add happiness into the criteria of uh, you know which country is doing better than. The, the next. So I guess that sort of raises questions on uh, the definition of a better country. 
you know, happiness or economic growth, GDP and all that jazz. Hey Carl, um, are you aware yeah. of any um, French foreign policy? If so, what? So far, what I know of French foreign policy is that due to the moderately socially, socialist approach that the government is taking, they rely too much on trying to fight the external pressures, especially with their involvement in NATO, when if you are French and you, if you are part of the French government and you say something for NATO, then you have less weight than America would, even though they're not part of that area in Europe. So, so far, I'm saying that this is the U.S. and this is France's butt. <laughs> That's it, yeah. Pretty much. That's all you know about the French policy. Do uh, you want me to get technical? Go ahead. Be my guest. Uh, okay, um, ever since Sarkozy's government, uh, nothing... There hasn't been anything politically relevant, at least in my view, um, among international relations, especially when dealing with the European Union. Um, because all the news that has been going out of France so far is are there domestic issues, the, the recent war, um, travel warning against France and most of Europe because of the terrorist plot, and, uh, and mostly France's stance on immigration and their immigration reform, especially because most of the Middle Easterners that are coming into France are displacing um, what the French, what they think the French culture actually is. So, um, I'm thinking France is going to have more international battles with Algeria, uh, the former North African French colonies around that area, especially because most of the illeg illegal immigrants are like coming from there. Yeah, Middle Easterners are what Mexicans are to the U.S into France and especially their yeah they hate Islam there a lot especially with the banning of the burqas uh, burqas and the niqabs um, the full body thing the burqas just a face the niqabs the thing that makes the women look like ninjas um, <laughs> yeah so they're going to have to deal with a lot more Middle East pressure especially when Ironically, the fighting of women, of human rights, especially the question of whether it is a woman, whether or not it is proper for the French government to dictate what a woman should wear. Uh, apart from labor issues, migrant issues, that's pretty much it. Okay, thank you, thank you. government with Nicolas Sarkozy as the president and Francis Fillion as the prime minister. France is the most visited country in the world and maintains the third largest income from tourism. It actually started its colonization as early as the 17th century and was not an active participant in the African slave trade. Rather, they were much more interested in exporting Arabic